He have his ups and downs, but you would never tell that he's sick because he just keeps smiling. He had tell me, Mama, I will let you know when to worry. Don't worry, I'm okay, I'm gonna be all right. When DeAndre was born, his liver looked at like he was a 40-year-old man been drinking for 20 years. He had cirrhosis of the liver. The doctor recommended that we go to UFL Mott Children's Hospital. It's the only pediatric liver transplant center in Michigan. They had to remove his gallbladder, which kept him alive. DeAndre was a year old. They told me that they needed a liver by the end of the month or they don't know which way it's gonna go. And to see my baby go from looking like a skeleton to where I can see his bones. His stomach was so big, he was so jaundiced to where I thought I was gonna lose him. It was February 11, 2004. DeAndre received his liver. He went down at 11 a.m. It took 12 hours for them to, to transplant him. When he got, the day he got his liver, I think the nurses and the doctors was more happier than what I was. When I cried, they cried. I think, if you would think that they had DeAndre and not me because they, all the pain he was going through, they went through it. When he started crying, they got to crying. Today, he's doing much better. We are so thankful to Dr. Lopez, his doctor at Mott. I will tell him thank you. I really love you because you gave my son a second chance at life. Only that you gave me a second chance with my baby. And I suggest anybody when you're going through a problem like that, U of M is, is the best hospital to be at for care. He just turned nine. My miracle baby is turning into a miracle young man.